Good evening, and get ready for our heavy competition filled with dancing, rage, and territorial differences. You're tuned into Dancing with the Czars. Let's meet our rock and royals of the day. Good day, I am Kate and this is my husband William. Hello. We have been practicing our English folk dance for many months now. Many. He's a lovely dance partner and has always been supportive for my love and talent of the art of dance. I'm positive that me and my hubby, Prince William, if I may boast, are sure to kick everyone's arses to the ground. Oh, well, uh, thank you, England. Next. Bonjour, je m'appelle François Hollin. Je suis le chef de France. I have been dancing for five years, and I am positive I will win. Au revoir. Merci, François Hollin. Up next are Russian competitors. I am Vladimir Putin. I am the leader of Russia. These are my assistants, Dmitry and Alekai. We are a dancing trio. We shall perform to some Russian folk tunes. Welcome to the show. Our final contestants? I'm Hillary. I am Bernie Sanders, Senator of Vermont. I am here to make this country greater grand. Trump. We are also a dancing trio, and we're making our country proud by taking home the first place title in this competition. Yeah! Mm-hmm. Make, Make America, America great, great again! Well, good luck to you, USA. Now, let's get the show on the road. Now, William and Kate take the stage for their classic folk dance. had quite a modern vibe, oh yeah. At first I thought you'd be too stuck in the medieval, but goody, it was interesting and not too traditional or it wouldn't catch the modern eye, oh. I like honestly think only old people would like what you just did. I mean, like you're supposed to be royalty and you wasted on that. Like, why would you come to America to star in my show if you can't even dance? Like, how embarrassing. After the break, Francois Holland will be showing us his ama amazing talent, but until then... Tollgate Codal, the one and only toothpaste brand that can white your teeth for a 48-hour time span. Just ask your trusted dentist. This is a very helpful toothpaste brand, but I didn't really know about it until I was paid to speak on it. And we're back to Dancing with the Czars. Now Francois Holland will be dancing the classical ballet. Good job, bud. Oh my goodness, that was fabulous. In Minnesota, we don't see ballet like that very often, and let me tell you, we have some pretty good athletes. Okay, like, I took ballet when I was three, and that is not it. Like, that was not acceptable on my show. And since when do, like, old French guys get to have ballet solos? Like, I'm honestly offended right now. Russians, the stage is now yours. <laughs> wow. 
good. Oh my! I've never experienced anything like that before! I really enjoyed all of the little jumps. Oh, they remind me of the little squirrels back in Minnesota that jump along the fence posts and eat their little nuts. Oh, I miss home. Yeah, uh huh, it was good. I'll tweet that video later. My phone's almost dead. Stupid battery life. Does anyone have a f iPhone 6 charger? 6 Plus, to be exact. Next, our American contestants will take the stage. That was cool. Nice job. Oh my! That is not American dancing at all! Oh dear! Oh my! This is too offensive to Americans all around! Oh! Now, it's time. You have voted. Here is the winner of Season 1, Dancing with the Czars. It's the Three Comrades! I told you Russians were the best. This concludes our first season of Dancing with the Stars. I hope you enjoyed our various styles of dance, and we'll see you next season on Dancing with the Stars.